feeling nervous. Don't be nervous, okay. this is gonna be funny. These are all really funny, Mix. Okay, okay. They're funny. Okay. okay. Welcome back to my channel. Today I thought we'd do a video that I've always wanted to do. I've seen some other people do this on YouTube where you send in your assumptions about me on Instagram. I haven't looked at them and we're gonna have a 10 minute timer where Tom's gonna read them out to me and I can't edit this video. So I can't edit any out. I can't edit out any reactions. <sighs> Petrified. <laughs> Petrified. I just gotta react on the fly to your assumptions about me and that's what we're gonna do today. So I can't edit the video, which A is scary. And I don't know how mean you've been with your assumptions. <laughs> I don't know what you've assumed about me. So shall we just begin? Do you wanna say hi? Hello boys. Tom's here and he's gonna read them out to me. I don't know what you guys are gonna have assumed some about me. Really? Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. Okay, okay, so Tom's gonna set a 10 minute timer yeah. and we're just gonna go. Oh my god, I feel like if I had my watch on right now, my heart rate would be like 10,000. Okay, 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 okay. All right, three, yeah, okay. Three, <laughs> two, one, go. You either like ketchup too much, like an excessive, or not at all. Like it is the ruiner of good things. <laughs> um, I like ketchup. Do you think I like ketchup more than it's average? Mayo. You're an uh, excessive <laughs> mayo muncher. <laughs> no, okay, I like most condiments. I quite like sauces. Next yeah. one. You have a child. <laughs> <laughs> I, the secret child? We've been hiding a child from the That's internet. <laughs> we don't, no, no child, no child here. What? How could someone assume I have a child? Okay. When you've drank too much, you get overly emotional and affectionate. I don't drink, so. So we don't know. So we don't know. We'll never know, she's a violent drunk <laughs> you're an extrovert um i don't know if i'm an extrovert or an introvert because i like being you know like around people and talking but also once i'm around when i'm around people for too long i have to go and be on my own because i get annoyed at them what would you say i think a bit of both a bit of both probably you have the biggest makeup collection ever i don't think so i would have said yes <laughs> Got a whole trolley over I have forest. no, no. So I have like okay. If you guys know like a what's the word for those? Oh my god, I'm tense. A book cart, book uh, cart. Like my book cut right, book where it's three time. levels. I have one level with like stationery, one with skincare, and one with makeup. I don't think I have an, an excessive. I have more makeup than maybe the average person, but not like an excessive amount. You love having a snack while reading. <laughs> Listen, she stinks with snack. I don't think I, I don't snack when reading. If I'm gonna no. have a snack, I'll have it before I read and then I'll start reading. I don't really like to snack when reading. You skip pages when you think a book is boring. No, I never skip pages. I might start reading quicker than I can actually take in the information. So like if I'm thinking a book is really boring and I have the audiobook, I'm upping that to like 3.5 and just getting through it as quick as I can. But I don't skip pages. <sighs> what? You thought about waiting for, for marriage to have sex, but didn't. <laughs> I don't know the answer to this one. No, I didn't. I went, uh, no, no. So I went to a Catholic school. I think that's more of an American thing. I didn't know anyone who, wait, who, like, at the Catholic school, you think, oh, there's gonna be those people who are gonna wait to marriage, but no one did. I think that's more of an American thing. Why? From, Why they from Little Duck Dog. Yeah. I like that name. <laughs> You're a people pleaser, anxious about performing well for others. Not judgment. I just think you're wonderful. <laughs> Thanks, little duck dog. Little duck dog. <laughs> um, I don't know. Maybe a bit. Maybe a little bit. But yeah, I, I think you're a people. I think you do get anxious, but yeah, fulfilling expectations. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, a bit. Wow. You judge people based on their favorite book. Um, if their favorite book is like Colleen Hoover, there may be a bit of judgment, but on the whole, no, I wouldn't say. If you were a book genre, you'd be mixed media. Oh yeah, well, yeah, well, yeah I suppose. I don't know what the fuck that means. Mixed media is when there's like emails in the book and like, to, I, oh, listen, it's cool. a bit of drama, it's a bit of, it's not cringe. Okay. Assuming you never want to get married. <laughs> no, never, no. Um, no, I, that's so interesting that someone would think that about me. Mm. Why would they assume that about me? I don't know. No, I definitely want to get married. Wow, that's so interesting. You're a girly girl. Yeah, I guess. So. Yeah. You come from a really lovely family. Oh. And you are really close. Yes. I think that's very true. I think that's very true. 
you're sick of having long hair and dealing with it, <laughs> but you don't think you'll look good with short. No, I'm never cutting my hair. I had short hair growing up. My whole, my mum can't do hair, so she made me have a bob the whole time growing up, and I hated it. I like going to school to get my hair cut, and they'd they'd call me Willy Wonka. All the kids. So I'm never having short hair ever again, and I don't mind long hair. It just takes ages to dry. I don't mind. Having you long look hair. like someone who wouldn't correct people if they got your name wrong. Oh, interesting. interesting. I definitely am, by the way. <laughs> I've got a history of that. I was going, right, I'm just going to be this person forever. <laughs> <laughs> um, would I correct them if they got my name wrong? Probably if it was just like the once, no. But if they were repeat me calling the wrong name, I would tell them what my actual name is. But I wouldn't be offended. Like, I wouldn't care. But I probably would tell them, like, I'm Megan. I, I think some of these people have got this phenomenally accurate. Like, mm. so, do, do, you read back through some of these. And you're like, yeah, <laughs> oh, no. Fun. Okay. Theming for books. You have tons of books scattered around the room slash house. I don't think I do. Yeah, I mean, we fucking do, man. <laughs> There's a whole... We've got a whole bloody room next door, just like... Okay, just okay, 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 okay. Yeah, maybe. Loft. It's in my bloody loft. <laughs> but I think here it's controlled. Like... Yeah, all right. I don't think it's that bad. Like, they're not all over the house. There's not some in the living room, some in the kitchen. You know what I mean? And to oppose our extroverted question, we've got one saying you're a shy girl with, shy girl. with monkey eyes emoji, <laughs> and you are introverted. That's so interesting. People so say different ones. A theme. I think I'm half and half, probably. Like I'm, I like to be around people and like, I don't know, chatting to people, whatever. But like, I really, if I'm around people for too long that aren't like my family or like the closest people around me, then I do get pissed off and I get fed up with them. Well, on that theme, oh. this is our most common question. Don't. You have a couple of good in-person <laughs> friends, but a lot of internet besties. Um, Your type of girl has a small, tight-knit group of friends. <laughs> you don't have a lot of friends. Sorry. <laughs> you know, Chelsea the bookworm. Sorry. <laughs> oh, um, I don't know what to s- How do I sum that up? I think throughout most of my life, when I was at school... I would always have, like, one best friend and, like, a tight-knit group of friends. But, yeah, I don't really have any friends right now. (laughs) But here's the thing, right? Like, I don't... I... I don't feel like right now my life is missing anything. Do you know what I mean? Like, I have my family, your family, you... Do you know what I mean? I feel like if... There was a point in my life where I feel like, oh, I really need some friends and I... But but also as an adult who's self-employed, like, how am I supposed to make friends? Like, where am I meeting people? I'm Costa Rica and making friends. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah, but I have friends on the internet, a lot of friends on the internet, and friends I've met through BookTube, other BookTubers. But, like, I think as an adult, it's really hard to make friends, especially if you don't work somewhere. Like, how are you supposed well, to make uni friends? Uni was difficult for you, wasn't it? Well, well, uni the was degree difficult was and disappointing. Degree was disappointing and COVID. COVID without half of our degree. So we're locked in a room together for like. We were locked in a room a together time. for like a year and a half. <laughs> And her talking to you motherfuckers for a year and a half. <laughs> Tom. I had to go and sit in, I had to you go and sit in the hallway. You, didn't, you never sat in the hallway. You would just sit at your desk. So all the videos that were filmed in Leeds, Tom is just sitting behind the camera pretty much at his desk. Yeah, it was horrible. Was garden, the there was no garden. And oh, he wasn't in the rain. <laughs> you like to play with makeup products. That's 100% accurate. Yeah. Big but name. I wish I was more adventurous with my makeup. Like sometimes I feel like triangle eyes to do. I know. I'm not sure it works. Um, I wish because often when I'm getting ready, I'm getting ready to film a video, and I'm like, I just want to get ready as quickly as possible so I can get this video done. So I wish I experimented with makeup even a bit more. But I do like doing that. You go to therapy. I work uh, in mental health, so I promise it's a good thing for me. Ah, uh, I have been to therapy in the past, but not not a lot. It was only briefly, and I don't currently. But I, w- I wouldn't, like, I just don't feel the need. When I when a need ar- arose for me to need therapy, I immediately went to therapy. But once that need was no longer there, I didn't keep going, you know? But I wouldn't be against it, you know? This one might be projecting, but I bet you're closest with your dad. You seem so secure with yourself. Oh, how do those two link up? I don't know. Um... Could you say closest with my yeah, dad? With I don't know. I think They're I'm... most similar. Yeah, so me and my dad are really... So me and my dad fight. Not fight, but like p- bicker more than me and my mum. But I'd say I'm equally close to both of them. Because me and my dad are so similar that the things that annoy us about each other are the things that we do. Mm. <laughs> 
anymore. I'm just looking if I've missed any. I'll try to group them, you see. Yeah, that's clever. That's clever. Oh my god, have we done them all before the timer? Yeah. Oh my gosh. I was like rushing through some of my answers. Bloody hell. Oh my god. Let me come off and then come back on again so there's no more responses. I doubt it. No cringe, no likes you. <laughs> right, we're a, okay. minute, we're a minute quick. Oh! Anything you want to add to? Um, the. The well, let's have a think. Let's, I think that it's a real interesting <laughs> combination. I can't get over the marriage and the There's sex before marriage ones. Like, they're really sexual. surprising for me, to me. And not loads of book questions either. No. So that's interesting, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, it's interesting. I just can't get over people thinking I, I think don't want to get married. That, I think that would basically say they know more about your interest in books than they do about you as a person. Yeah, maybe I don't share enough. See, here's the thing. Sometimes I, I feel like other booktubers share more about their life than I do because I just think why would oh time has gone off I kind of like when I begin speaking about personal stuff I think why would anyone care about that like why do they care but I know people do care about that but, like about you but I friends, yeah but I only really like in vlogs I tend to just talk about the books because I think why would anyone care about me in the, no but you know what I mean I don't know I feel like why would why is something that I'm experiencing like interesting enough to be shared with thousands of people surely they're just here to hear about the books yeah i don't know but sometimes i do think i should share more about certain things in my life i guess but i don't also, know i mean it takes up a lot of your time yeah most of my life is just yeah, reading and making videos you do a lot of that <laughs> okay well that was interesting i cannot i am stuck on the i don't want to get married and i waited well, people, until yeah. marriage to have sex you have a kid I have a child. You have some cats. I have cat children, but no, no yeah. secret child that I'm child. hiding away. Yeah, people on a stream before said you're a horse girl, so maybe they think. <gasps> oh my god. Horse girl, waiting for. They just think you're just some sort of Christian, yeah. like. <laughs> but don't you think? I don't think the waiting until marriage to have sex is really a thing in the UK, even among religious I people. Possibly common. <laughs> no, but I knew a lot of religious people, and I don't think that was a I thing. Know. No, I knew. I went to, you know, I went to a girls' Catholic school, and no one was saying I'm going to wait until marriage to have sex. No, no one, why would you? No one was saying that. So, I think it's more an American thing. Mm. Anyways, that was interesting. Wow, that was mm. that was a moment. Mm. <laughs> so thank you guys for sending in those subjects about me. That was very interesting. My heart feels like it just went a thousand beats per minute. <laughs> but yeah, thank you for sending in those assumptions, and yeah, let me know. I guess what you would like to know more about about me in my videos because like I said sometimes I get nervous about sharing that kind of stuff and thinking people will be interested in it or not so anyways thank you guys for watching this video I hope it was a little fun one it was going up on Easter Sunday so I figured people would be busy with their families anyways and so it would be nice to have like a quick fun one I don't know again is Easter Sunday a thing in like America or is that more of a British thing? I don't know I don't know. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. If you got to the end of the video, leave a rabbit face emoji because it is Easter Sunday and I'll see you very soon in another video. Bye.